Okay, so, um, here are the creations and stuff. They're not all charms. So, first I made this one for a contest. It's a nine cat over the top cake, and there are four layers in total. Um, I've never made this, like, over the over the top cake thing before, so yeah. And this, um, idea was inspired by clay pens that people did. Like, they took the pen, they wrapped the rainbow around it, so I thought that was pretty cool. And I was gonna do seven colors, like, the seven rainbow colors, excluding indigo, but, um, I couldn't really see the um, sky part, so I want to, like, paint stuff to kind of make people, like, recognize what, like, theme it is. So, um, there's Nine Cat, and the first two layers, although you can't really see the separation, are just a regular, um, theme, and the colors are, um, blue, yellow, and red. Then there's Halloween, so there's orange, purple, and black, and there are some bats with a gold background, and the last theme is Christmas, and there's red, gold, and... Um, green and they're just some like really puffy snow and this took me about four hours to paint so yeah with wood is really fun so here are like the transitions and yeah so it's pretty big so okay um then um i made a mako scarf and he is a character from the legend of korra and that's a, such an awesome show i love avatar and the legend of korra so yeah when i say avatar and korra i mean the shows but if i say avatar korra and avatar Aang, i mean the people just so you guys don't get confused so this is a mako scarf I sculpted it myself. It's kind of odd because there are more fringes here than on that side. Yeah. And then I wanted to make something a bit more challenging. Well, it wasn't really challenging actually. It was pretty easy to make. Just the tail deck frustrated me. So it's this uh, Pabu charm. He is um, the pet of Bolin, who is Mako's brother. So um, actually it's Mako. Sorry if I pronounce it wrong. It's Mako. Not not Ma Wait, I don't know how I said it. Okay, just never mind. Okay, um, the hard part, actually, the face was pretty easy, but the tail is so annoying because I don't want to say the C-R-A-P-P-Y word, but I'll just use Krabby instead. So, Krabby Craft Smart is so soft, and then I had to, like, put it in the refrigerator for one hour. It took me one hour to make this tail, and it's so ugly because, um, if I touched it, then it would, like, smudge everywhere, so I had to refrigerate it in between every line. So, that was so frustrating. Okay, then I have... Um, One Direction charms. So I'm going to show you them in the order that I made them. So here's Nile, and I'm pretty happy with how his hair turned out because I've never made chibis before. So I liked how all their hair turned out and bodies too. So I added little hands because I thought that would be, be cute. So there's Nile, and he's the smallest, like, in the band. And also, I accidentally made him the smallest. I don't know why. They kind of like went small and then big and then it kind of went medium and then big. So yeah, and then there's Harry and people who do Harry's hair, um, oh now fell. Okay, um, they don't normally do it like that, so I thought this was cool. And they're just wearing their concert outfits, so he's wearing his like suit thing and now he's wearing his red polo. And um, these um chibis were inspired by Crafty Olivia, mainly the hairstyles because I looked her at her um pictures, so for reference. <laughs> then um, I made Zing. And I don't like his hair, but it still turned out pretty good. So he's wearing his blue the trimming with them. And then I made Liam, and I painted on the plaid stripes. And yeah. Then I made Louis, and he's the biggest out of all of them. Like, not in the band, but like of what I made. Um, and he's wearing his blue stripes and red suspenders. Same suspenders. And I love. Oh my god. Wow, he knocked Harry. What a coincidence. Okay, um. He, um, uh, sorry, that's too funny. Okay, not really. Well, not if you're, you don't understand it, but, okay, never mind. Probably directioners won't know what I mean, but, okay. Um, so, I like his hair. End of story. So, my friend's birthday party is tomorrow. Her birthday was actually last week, and she asked for this, like, more than two months ago, so I feel really bad. Excuse me. Okay, um, so I made her... It's Justin Bieber Chibi, and it's his clothes that he wore in his music video of Boyfriend. And I don't like Justin Bieber, but, um, I like his music, so... Well, I mean, I don't hate him, but... Well, no, I like him, but not, like, crazy like him. Like, he seems pretty nice. Yeah. So, it just says JB. And it's on a cell phone strap, so I'm giving that for her birthday. Because she's an awesome friend. Um, then, this is for my friend, too. She also asked for this. She asked for Purple Ninja, and... I think this is what she heard, sorry if I, like, misunderstood it, if I get the fact wrong, um, she said that before Beliebers were called Beliebers, they were called Purple Ninjas, 
because purple is his favorite color, color and I don't know anything about the ninjas part, but yeah, so sorry if you're like a hardcore believer and I got that wrong. Don't hate. I'm not a believer. Okay, yeah, and then she has a verified believer because she's a believer, trust me. Um, it's on a purple dangly thing. Next, um, I normally don't ask credit. I don't think I've ever asked for credit, but this time I feel it's so special to me and I would really hate to see if someone took this and said it was their idea. So if you do make this, please give me credit and I, I hate people who ask credit like on everything. But this is only one item, so I, I don't want to sound mean or anything, but I'm just asking for credit because it's just one item that is so special to me. I mean, it's original, but it's not very original. So, okay. So I'm going to show in the order I made it. Okay, so I made three. One for me. This one is for my friend who asked for it. And this one is for the shop. So I'm going to be selling these. So um, I'll, um, I made um, a drawing of this um, in March. So here's the picture. And um, it's called Direction Cat, so it has all like qualities that each member likes or has or whatever. So um, Harry likes cats, Liam likes turtles, Nile, Irish equals leprechauns equals rainbows, and also gold. So um, yeah, rainbows. And Zane likes mirrors, of course. Louis likes carrots. So it's direction cat and I really love this idea these were actually pretty easy to make they only took me 20 minutes and I love these so 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 much so if you do plan to make these please give me credit sorry that's all I'm asking for this is the only charm I've ever asked credit for in like since April 2011 so it's more than a year and I've never asked credit for anything so I'm sorry this charm day was really long but like I have over 60 charms so I think it's pretty reasonable for me to have a like 10 plus minute video so yep thank you so much for watching I really hope you enjoyed all the charms I made I had so much fun making them and I also hope you really um, like them because I love these charms, they are my personal favorite, and I think I've improved a lot in polymer clay, so I'm really proud of these. And that's pretty much it, so thank you so much for watching this long video if you've reached the end. Hopefully you haven't skipped it, because that's kind of weird, but um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Thank you so much for watching. Bye!